Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Laura with Stitching with Laura. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a great day. Well, we have another unbagging. So let's see what we have inside. Kind of a big, huge bag, but I don't think there's a whole lot in it. Nope. Oh. And sure that's it get the bag out of the way well we have a diamond painting and a cross stitch and these are from the GBKFE store and we just have two things so let's look at the diamond painting first since it's the biggest biggest thing we got going here get it out of the way and this is another fairly big one let me put my bag. I always save those bags that they come in because they're nice to store if you have to. All right. Let's see which way is up. This is a 40 by 80. And as you can see, there's lots and lots of pinks. Yep. And that it also has the item number here on top. Let's unroll it so it's kind of long and tall and skinny. And I will insert a picture here. All right. Ugh. And it has a big old wad of, what do you call it? Oops, a piece of, extra piece of paper. This has 21 colors. That is a long thing of colors, but there's a lot to be done here. Comes with two boats, two pieces of wax, and two pins. We'll just set that aside. But as you can see, it's like the corner of a a pagoda. Whoops, did I get it to lay flat? And let me see if I can raise this up just a bit so we can see more with like a pink sakura tree or it might be plum blossom I'm not sure but it is poured glue it should lay down pretty flat I don't see too much of a reason to to iron it but aren't those just beautiful look at all the pinks holy moly a lot of pink and purple oh I gotta lay it sideways it just ain't working for me hang on I gotta find a place to sit stuff I'll have to take this into my bedroom and lay it down on the bed but yeah it is lots and lots of pinks we'll start at the top so you got all the flowers and the tree and then comes the building in right here just beautiful just absolutely beautiful hmm okay I'm gonna lay it sideways see if I can measure it I don't know that I can or can't okay so it's supposed to be 40 by 80 we'll do the very best we can on some of these big ones it's kind of hard so it's 80 across right on the money and get it to turn please and 40 right across or the short way the actual picture is 70, well, almost 72. We'll call it at 72, which is 28, a little over 28 and a quarter by 32, which is a little over 12 and a half. So not bad. It's kind of a nice skinny size. 
but I just think it's going to be beautiful with all those blossoms. Mm. And that green to kind of offset everything. It'll be gorgeous. Let's take a look at all these drills. Holy cow, that's a lot of drills. Okay, let me get that out of the way so it can stop crinkling. Ooh, this has got lots of pinks and purples in it. Just absolutely beautiful. Beautiful colors. Mm, look at that one. Mm, so bright and sparkly. This is a round, of course. Let me check the thing. It does have... Let me turn it around before I get any further here. It has the product number and the number that is on the, the key. On each one of them, it doesn't give a DMC number, but there are DMC numbers. I don't think I can do this. There are DMC numbers on here and the, the symbol and then the number. So, lots and lots lots. Look at, oh, look at that one. Looks like raspberries. And purples. Isn't that a pretty purple? Mm. And we even have some, like, brick red. And, of course, you're going to have some 310 in there. 310 and 3777. Not 3771. You have to have something for that tree in the building. Just absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Mm, yeah. Beautiful. And this does have... Just a minute. Let me do this. Hang on. Lay them up there so they don't make so much noise. There is some dark parts here, so I might have to use my, uh, my light pad. But this is very sticky. Very nice drill field. Yeah, I'll have to lay this out on something flat. But yeah, and it's so, so sticky. Sometimes they're not so sticky. But I do like the poured glue. Instead of the uh, double-sided glue. It's just being a pain today. It's getting a little staticky. So sorry. There, I get it as good as I can. But I think it's just absolutely stunning. Just stunning with that pink tree. I saw that one. Yep, gotta have it. Just absolutely beautiful. And it's not so big that you could hang it you know, in a small area up and down. Because isn't it less than... I've got to look again. Hang on. Three feet? It's, yeah, it's 20... 28 and a half-ish. You know, once you finish it. So it's a little over two feet. Four inches. So yeah, oh, I think it'll be beautiful. Just absolutely beautiful. Roll it kind of easy, and we'll take a look at the cross stitch. Now, this one was, hang on, just set it someplace where it won't fall over. Let's see, where are you? It's cherry blossom. It was twelve fifty nine, and this one is ten twenty nine. And as you can see, it is. Whoop, let's turn it right around the right way is a spring kit. It's 37 by 37 centimeters and it's an 11 count. And it's supposed to be the, what do you call it? Bamboo trees and these two little birds. So we'll see how it goes. Let me pull everything out of here. I love these packages. Just love them. They're practically indestructible. Let's turn this over. So you have your picture, nothing on the back of that, 
but it's a partial and it's not very big has a little bit of you know back stitching in within the birds to kind of define them I don't see any other maybe their feet and around their eyes but that's about it not not big at all it take you maybe less than a month to do this if you just put your mind to it does have one of those instruction things on what to do with it and after it and before it and how to you know do your threads and everything which is nice does have a separate page here with all the colors so you can kind of keep it by your side you don't have to have the the paper with you all the time I don't know I'm looking here has 25 colors there is one mixed color uh, number two and number one mix those together they look almost the same but one is a dark green and the other one is black 310 <coughs> and it's green 500 let's take a look at this I'm getting there I like how they put it in a separate plastic bag Sometimes they even put the material in a plastic bag all by itself. Comes with a little card. I don't know that it is or isn't a sticker. Kind of feels thick like a sticker, but very nice. Let's look at those beautiful colors. Lots of greens. A little bit of reddish. It's like a brick red. But more so greens because you got your your bamboo things and you have to have some tans and browns and a little bit of yellow for the birds mostly black there's a lot of 310 there but only one mixed color you got four different colors for your back stitching and the full stitch is 25 but the whole thing only has 25 colors but look at those greens mm -mm 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 nice soft thread they always have the nicest kits and I've never I've only bought their bigger kits not their the small ones like this one 35 to 30 by 35 sorry I needed to drink my bad comes with two needles right there see what the canvas looks like I'm trying to get it right side up but as you can see there's not much stitching here nice and square nice big key right here and these are all your half stitches I think did it have half stitches let me look did I miss something full stitch back stitch no there's no half huh just weird I was looking to see if no this key does not match this key at all so I don't know it just sounds kind of useless to me, but okay. Weird. Does have the DMC numbers, the thread color, and what you're stitching. So it's nice and bright and easy to read. Let me bring it down just a bit here. My goodness. So you can maybe see how nice that is. I won't move it. But nice, nice pattern. Very bright and vivid this time. Now, I got another one, and it was all done in, um, what do you call it, pastel colors. So, yeah. Just lovely. Let's see how big it is. It's supposed to be 35 by 35. It is surged all the way around. So it's 36 and a half this way. And almost 36 on this way. And then this is 27 and a half by, yeah, I'm coming, 28 and a half. So, not very big. Like I said, it wouldn't take you too long to stitch it. And it is an 11 count. I don't know if I said that or not. My bad. If I didn't, I have, forgive me does say it's 126 by 126 stitches this is the product number 
it says spring at the top there's some Chinese instructions over here and at the bottom but you really shouldn't need it it's just straight stitching except for a minimal minimal amount of what do you call it back stitching where is that pattern I wanted to look at something nope I guess that's just the pattern it looked like this part was right here was back stitch but it's their lines going that way but see on the pattern it's actually you yeah you cross stitch it that's just the symbol for that one yep it's right there number seven right there but it looked bad but or not bad but yeah got to do that part and there is just one mixed one it's just the first two threads so yeah I really am happy with the smaller um, uh, spring kits very nice very nicely done you know they're they're up there with joy Sunday I mean as far as being organized and very well put together and the patterns are printed nice so there is nothing wrong with these I like their huge ones, but never done too many, you know, small spring ones. But I do like them. Like them more and more. And it doesn't say on the site, you know, that they are or aren't spring kits. It's just catch as you can. I mean, I know this one now is a spring, but. And I think this one is the bamboo, and I think there's like three others done in similar fashion to the ones that were from the romantic story bunch so there's four of those and then there's four of these but these are all either square i don't know that they're all square a couple might be round i don't know you have to check them out just look in that same uh money size you know this one was what did i say ten dollars or something like that so look within that range of money and you might find the other three that go with this I was looking for actually the bamboo that goes with the romantic story ones that are long and skinny well I haven't been able to locate that they haven't had it in stock so I don't know when or if those will ever show up all right guys I'll be back in a few minutes and we'll start something all right, guys, I am back, and we are going to start the bamboo. And the color that I'm using is 503. It's kind of a, I don't know, a gray-green, if you will. Trying to get it to lay down. Really? To run my needle up there again. Hang in there. We're going to get it. Operator error. There we go. It's really a pretty color green. This wouldn't take any time at all to stitch. I'm just happy you don't have to do the background color because that would be a pain. Yeah, I'm not much on background colors. You know, you better fill that canvas up for me. But that's just me. And this uh, canvas is nice. I crunched it down just a bit, you know, so that we could kind of break it in. And I'm really close to the the edge. But I think I'll be getting more and more like 30 by 40s, you know, or 35 by 35s. Maybe I can find the rest that goes with this. I'm not sure. I had two or three of the uh, 
plum blossom already, so I kind of wanted to go off on a so-called different tangent, if you will, and do something different, but <coughs> I like to get things that are in a series. See if we can kind of let that thread relax a minute. Wasn't much to stitch right there, was there? Oh, I guess I could have gone on the other side, but oh well, life goes on. We're getting it. Using three strands, of course. Since it is an 11 count, and I do have my thimble on. Because I've about ruined my my finger for pushing things through the through materials. Not that the material was tough. It's just I do so much of it, and yeah, gets me in trouble. And I don't use my uh, thimble half the time because you know. It is what it is. So I'm my own worst enemy. I'll get used to using it again. Actually had to diamond paint the other day. Just because I couldn't hardly move a, a needle through the, the fabric. It happens. And my hands are kind of cracked from... What do you call it? Being winter and stuff like that. I try to use hand lotion when I remember it. But, oh well. We're good. Oh, we got that good. Now the GBFKE store sells diamond painting and cross stitch, as you saw. They have counted and they also have embroidery which is nice I have to try some embroidery sometime it's been good lord wow maybe 20 some years since I've done any kind of embroidery so I'd like to kinda revisit that just on a small basis nothing huge and they don't ever have huge embroidery things there at any of the stores that I've visited. You know, usually the picture is fairly small. You know, maybe 10 or 12 inches square. Maybe. Don't know. I haven't gotten one in person, so I'm not real sure. But it'd be kind of something different to look at and do. I think I still remember how to make all those stitches. And let's see, they have mystery diamond paintings as well. They have, they don't have a separate uh, Joy Sunday section. Which is kind of disappointing, but I think they do mark them as being Joy Sunday. Because Joy Sunday is their biggest cross-ditch type. You know, well-known, you know what I mean. And I have yet to see any names on anything else. So, Joy Sunday stands out. Of course. I know you can't hardly see where I stitch, can you? There's another thread. I need my. This didn't come with a a threader. I just have about 50 of them now. I also have the thing that I got them separately. 
I think you can actually order those, you know, from them. I ordered mine, God, it's been three years at, uh, yeah, at uh, Amazon. Came in a pack just like that. I think there was 50 or 100 in there, so we still got plenty to go. And every once in a while a kit will um, come with them. But they're the best thing I've ever seen. It's like, I don't know how I ever got along before without them. But I'm, I'm kind of liking these smaller things, you know. Some of them are uh, partials and some are full coverage. What else? Oh, they have diamond painting crafts. And cross stitch crafts, you know, like the bookmarks or that kind of thing. No, they don't have crafts here. Sorry. They have diamond painting crafts, but not cross stitch crafts. Now, I don't know. Maybe I'm not looking in the right place, but usually they have uh, bookmarks and, you know, smaller things for you. So that's helpful. and I believe they have tools they usually have deals so if there is a deal on the site I will put it down in the description you know like buy three get one free or buy four get one free sometimes they have so much off site wide so that's kind of nice But it's coming up on Easter, so and they have lots of new arrivals in both cross stitch and diamond painting. So yeah. Very nice. Maybe if I just kept stitching on just this, I could get this done in a week. Don't know. Maybe. We'll see. We will see. Let's see what color that is. It's kind of a medium seafoam green. It's got more gray to it, you know, a little bit of black that makes it not so green looking. All right, guys. Well, thank you, GBK, I mean, GBFKE, for sending me these beautiful kits. I know I'm going to love that diamond painting. Oh my goodness, I can't hardly wait. Oh yeah, lots and lots of colors. Love that part. And these have beautiful colors too, so we'll see what we can work on this week. Thank you for joining me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and please hit the bell. That way you'll know when my next video comes out. Stay safe, stay healthy. We'll see you next time. God bless. Bye-bye. Keep stitching and diamond painting.